eating the, the algae in St. Louis. You get what I'm saying? Yes, yeah, they're eating everything. Yes, yeah, Seamoss, the back builder. Yes. Yeah, so, <laughs> so, yeah, so, like, that's crazy how you guys were able to break that down. I want to say thank you. Um, now this requires me to do more research, you know, because, you know, it's so much, man, so much algae in the ocean. Because when you click on Cronus and the family, you're like, I don't know nothing. <laughs> Dude, I spent like almost eight months. Yeah, and I'm sure Matthew's been doing it for like the last two years. Like, yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, there's so much to learn. It's crazy. And you're always I mean, new stuff. Yeah, I'm telling you. I'm Julian, imagine, um, was it late, late last year? Mm -hmm. I came across, I think I, 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 I typed it in the, in, the, in the chat. I came across things, some seaweed that was looking very much like Chonda's crystal. I'm like, what? It, it has the same kind of sun like mm -hmm. um, um, leaves, but it was just a bit bigger. And I was, I, I've been trying to get somebody from the Department of Fisheries to help me identify this plant, but not, not no success yet. But it, it, it's, it's so, funny you say that because when we were setting up the farms over there by Obicon, we left yeah. the boats there for a long while. And then... Um, we came back to clean the ropes because you know it gets all the moss yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. and things i noticed that was growing in the ropes was some sea moss that was like baby but they had the flat flower like it. and now yeah. mm -hmm. wait a minute this doesn't look like garcelaria or euchinema but i was like i shrugged it off as maybe this is like just a baby you know yeah, yeah. initial stage stages of growth that's what it's going to look like but now that mm -hmm. you do that i'm like hmm i wonder if this is what he's talking about because yeah it's crazy mm -hmm. it 